the 102.9 and that gives us on our valve heights a number of 40 but that means that it's 60 thousandths below the deck because our indicator measures up to zero so we've just cut eight rough cuts Now we're at plus 20, it means we cut 80 thousandths off the head. So we need to do one finish cut of 9 thousandths and that'll give us our finished height and the head will be at 85 cc. So in order to calculate how much to cut off of this cylinder head, what we initially do is we CC the head with the finished valves and the finished valve pipes. Then we calculate the circumference of the combustion chamber and we use a formula that calculates inches of circumference to volume because we measured the combustion chamber in cc's. So doing the math from 102.9 with our valve height at minus 60, we've got a combustion chamber volume of five thousandths per cc and that's after doing the calculation of the volume tells us how many thousands per cc now we know that the finished size of the head needs to be 85 that tells us we need to take 17.9 cc's off the head so in order to measure that value we measure the valve before and the valve valve out and the valve after and that's going to be 89 thousandths difference and that gives us our 85 cc. 